right, so there you see Seth Petrozelli, the ultimate fighting star at eight and four, but Bernard Rutherford is undefeated, so it makes it a very interesting matchup. He said he's not worth my time. I'm not even going to talk about him. We're going to find out whether or not the Roughneck is worth a little bit of Seth's time. The Roughneck versus the Silverback. The Silverback is in black and white trunks. The Roughneck is in gray trunks. Don't blink here, folks. It's the light heavies. It's the main event. Bernard's going to want to try and get this thing on the ground. Seth's going to want to stand it up. You see him going for the takedown, but he's got to be careful because Seth has finishing power. Yeah, Seth has power all around. He's got power in his, he throws bricks, he throws unbelievably strong kicks, and he has great ground game, and you'll see that on display if the Roughneck takes him off his feet. And he's just walking him down every time, but every time he throws out one of those kicks, you see Bernard going for that leg, going for the takedown, but if you go for that takedown, you better get it. Yeah, you better set, get the set, takedown. Exactly. I mean, Petrozelli's a bigger, he's a bigger light heavyweight. He's really a natural heavyweight. That 205, I, I bet that was tough to get down to for him. He's a big guy. Seth's the taller guy. He's got the longer reach. You see him getting the jab in there, got a straight right in there as well. And Bernard's still just trying to figure out, how do I get to this guy? That's how he's going to have to get there. But as I said, if, you, if you're going to go for him, you better get him down or you're going to pay for it. Yeah, exactly. Great takedown defense there by Seth Petrozelli. And I think I saw a part of that cage just bend when they slammed into it. That's a lot of weight slamming into that cage. Th that's a whole lot. Bernard uh, um, might want to go by the name Big Daddy as well. He's got a big guy and he just took a, a high <laughs> kick to the side of the head there. Seth, Seth's multidimensional. He's a guy who can do a little bit of everything. Bernard better figure out a way to get close because fighting at this distance is not going to work for him. I mean, that's a lot of flexibility for a big man. I mean, that was a head kick. Yeah, yes, that's it, but that's what you can do when you've got those long legs and you're fighting against a smaller guy like that. He's touching him with the fist up top, and, and, and he's getting the kicks down low, and now he's got backing him up to the cage. I'm telling you, he needs to get this fight to the ground. Big right there, catching the sight. Oh, and Rutherford is in trouble. I think that it's over. <laughs> it's over. Seth Petroselli destroying Bernard Rutherford. It's everything we talked about. If you're going to go for the takedown in the leg, you better get it. If not, you're going to pay. And we saw Bernard pay right there <laughs> by getting TKO <laughs> and check out the dance from Seth. I'm not sure what that was, but, but Petroselli shaking off the right fist. He clobbered Rutherford three times hard in his noggin. Happened fast. <laughs> Happened oh so fast. It was a left, a right, and a left, right, and then he here. caught him when he was down on one knee with that one big right. That's a show closer. <laughs> that is what right there. Now? Let's Ladies go up to the ring announcer and make it official. Ladies and gentlemen, make some noise for every fight we had tonight. We had true warriors. We thank you for coming out. We're here with the Silverback, Seth Petrozelli. A big win tonight by knockout. It's been a while since you've been in the ring. Had a couple of setbacks. Now you looks like you're right on track again. How'd you feel coming into this fight tonight? I, I got to tell you the truth. I was, I was a little bit nervous. Um, I, I lost I, <laughs> MHS rules. I lost my uh, last two fights, you know. I wanted to get back in here, get a winner in my belt. Um, went against a tough opponent. He was undefeated, so... Wanted to come down here and uh, show them what I got. Well, you said you came here to make it pretty, and that's exactly what it was. One of the most beautiful knockouts we saw tonight. Thanks again. You did a great job, and we can't wait to see you fight again in the future. I'll be back here in the future. Thank you all. Thanks all the fans and everybody that supports me. Thank you very much. I love you all.